my April Brimbles box arrived this morning and so I decided to get my camera out and film the unboxing right now. <laughs> um, I've gone for the smaller scissors today in the hope that I don't slice my thumb open like I did last time. <laughs> Like the previous Brimbles boxes, this is a piece of Anna's artwork on the postcard. So the postcard has some song lyrics at the top, which I'm not going to try singing because I cannot sing to save my life. But it says, when it's pouring rain and people complain and things aren't worth the shucks, don't you yell, just say, well, lovely weather for ducks. And those song lyrics are by Rosemary Clooney. And then the next part of the postcard says, Someone once said, if it wasn't for the weather, the British wouldn't have anything to talk about. Well, there's nothing us Brits love more than to talk about the weather, it seems. When it's cold, it's too cold. And when it's hot, well, it's too hot. We are never happy, are we? I know a lot of people don't, but I quite like the rain. There is nothing, and I mean nothing, like the smell after it has rained, or the way the road looks, all glistening with puddles, ready to go splashing in. One of my favourite pastimes as a child was putting my wellies on and jumping in puddles. Hey, who am I kidding? I still do that now. <laughs> I'm a massive cloud gazer too. But I could watch the clouds go by for hours. I love it. So let's celebrate those April showers because without them there'd be no May flowers. Much love, Anna. I love this little sticker. It says lovely weather for ducks. Ah, oh, look. Oh my god, that's so cute. Oh my gosh, I don't know where to start. Okay. <laughs> So first up, there's this adorable little duck paperclip. If you guys know me, you know I love my yellows. So this is probably gonna have a permanent place in my planner. So next up, there's this little duck and it squeaks. Who's that? Who's that? <laughs> I have a feeling I'm going to drive my dog absolutely bonkers with this little duck. I love how it's got little eyelashes. I'm going to have to name it. If you have any good duck names, then leave them in the comments and I might just choose your name to name my little duck. Next, I can see some rainbow washi. I've had these in the past. I really love them. I love them for my planners. First time I got a pack of these, I used them up so quickly. Very happy to have another set of those. I've seen these before as well, actually. I think I've seen these on my eBay travels. Um, they are teeny tiny little stamps. They're perfect, again, for planners or diary entries or something where you've got, like, small space to work with. And they've got, like weather on them so it's got lightning and thunder rainbow windy day cloudy day rainy day snowy day shiny day and sunny day those are really really cute yeah those are called schedule stamps and this is obviously the weather set mm, this is this is different this is by a etsy shop called the red penny press and that i've never seen it i'm assuming that's paper clip so the little card says hello my clip marks your page my button peeks over your book and my tail tucked in or flies free i'm handmade just for you by the red penny press i'm gonna have a nosy at their etsy shop when i'm done filming this and i'll leave a link to their etsy shop in the description as well if you guys want to go have a look next there is some thank you cards what what do you want mush They've got little cups and spoons on the front and they're kind of glittery as well. I don't know if that's picking up on camera. <laughs> so yeah, they're kind of, they've got glitter on them. They're really, really cute. Oh my gosh, that is so, so cute. What is it? Oh, it's postcard. <gasps> it's so simple, but it's so colourful at the same time. I love that. Oh, oh my gosh, there's more than one. Oh, those are so nice. I don't know what the heck I'm going to use them for, but I have a feeling they're going to be hoarded for a while. So the person who designed these has actually got an Etsy shop as well. So again, I'll leave that link below. So next there is this little notebook with clouds all over it. And they all have little faces on. Love, love, love that. I have a thing at the moment for grid paper. Look how cute they all are. I like the one with the little tongue. Or the one with the tiny little tooth. Next up there is some drawing market stickers let's have a look oh wow look at them there's like something for everything there's like these ones which are like little stamps so i can use them for snail mail and then they've got these ones which i've seen these sort of ones before they're kind of they're see-through so if you write if you write something say in your planner then you can just stick one of these over the top and it kind of highlights it or frames it i love these ones they're like not quite perfect kind of scribbled oh and i've just realized they're triangles i get it i get it it's the same layout on each one they've just got different patterns and designs on it i'm probably gonna end up having like one page in my planner 
one page in my sticker box, one in like my pen pal planner. They're gonna be all over the place. Next, there's these adorable stickers. It's felt stickers again, those are so sweet. I'm probably gonna end up using a couple of them in my smash book and then probably saving the rest. Not quite sure. <laughs> the next thing is this to-do list. There's something about writing a list on a pretty to-do list which motivates you to get things done so much quicker. I like the size of these ones, they're kind of long and thin. A lot of the other to-do lists that I've got are kind of shorter and wider. So yeah, it's nice to have one this size. This is kind of perfect shopping list size. And then lastly, <laughs> oh cute. I think that's lastly. I love these ducks that are in here. Those are gonna get smash booked. <laughs> So yeah, lastly, there is one of these duck pens. I actually had these stocked myself on my stationery shop at one point. I never really kept one for myself because obviously it was stock rather than buying for me. So now I have one of my own. How cute is he? So that was everything that I got in my April's Brimbles box. I think this box has to be my favourite by far just because of the theme of it. You guys know what I'm like with my colour. I absolutely love bright colours, rainbows. It just all looks so cheerful and happy. So yeah, I absolutely love it. I hope you enjoyed this video. I am now going to go find homes for all of this stuff. Let me know in the comments if you have any questions and I'll see you in my next video.